Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. Today we're doing a reading for sign of Libra. And keep in mind that this will not resonate for every Libra. If you'd like a personal reading, that is going to be in the description down below. I also have sound healing sessions available and tarot classes. All that's in the description down below. For you to go check out. There's also a bunch of other things there. But let's see what message we have for you. We have Shimmer. Number 39, glamour, confidence, allure, charisma. This is number 38 with the green man's bride, sacred union, commitment ceremony, maturing into deep relationship. Number 21 with crystal magic, creation, dawn, the beginning. Number six with dark moon, maturation, growing up, introspection, know thyself. Number 12, the gossamer princess, communication, relationship work to be done. Number nine. All right, you have a Nikola Tesla code here. We have three, six, nine. We have Silver Sisters. Time to take protection from toxic thoughts and energy. All right, Libra. What I feel like for you is I feel like you have a connection here that you may be going into commitment with, or maybe you're already committed to this person. Your, your relationship's going to be maturing a lot, is the point, the good and the bad, Libra. Here, there's like a lot of work to be done between you and your person in your relationship is what I feel for you. But I do feel like there is a commitment there. But there may be some patching up to do as well. I feel like you'll be fine. Um, you're also connecting with the green man. The green man is the spirit of the earth, all right, which you'll be committing to as well. Maybe you're also working with crystals and that could represent your commitment to the green man here. Now, Silver Sisters, that card talks about... That, that can talk about a person or a group of people around you that appear to be very um, nice and very light and like they never do anything, but they're actually very fake and quite toxic. That, that'd be people that you need to protect yourself from, kind of distance yourself and really um, protect your energy or field here. You can listen to meditations for that. Or maybe you're working with crystals to kind of protect yourself from people like this. All right, Libra. So, what we'll be having a look at is the Green Man's Bride. Number 38. The Green Man. The wild heart of the masculine has found his bride. The beloved, who was able to be both intimate and free from their new love. True connection has grown. And now they are preparing to celebrate their joining under the heavens and upon the earth. For when love is developed and grown, there comes a time to make a commitment of the heart. The kind that comes when a relationship or partnership has reached a stage of where some kind of sacred ceremony will take forward, take it forward into a greater, richer place where maturity and growth will be given fertile ground to work in. And where you create together will have foundation, roots, and be solid. For this card speaks of the wedding ceremony between the green man and the bride. And this takes both into a new stage of their relationship. No longer are they fresh and green, giddy from the euphoria of new love. Their love is deeper, richer, and has taken on a strong life of its own. It's now time to sanctify this relationship by acknowledging its important its import to those involved. To make vows, to exchange symbols, and to join together at a deeper, more lasting level. The wild man of the forest has found his beloved. The innocent bride is ready to become a partner in a woman. They retain their wild fairy selves, selves, but they know that they are ready for a long-term honoring of their love in their union. It says, There may be a wedding, an engagement, betrothal, hand fasting, or commitment ceremony coming up for two people who are in love, and who are ready to take the next step into their future as loving, wise partners joined in sacred union, extension of family, pondering children and growth together, contemplating the direction of a relationship in its future. When this takes place, the joy of the commitment between the lovers extends the fertile into for, extends to fertility in the land. The turning of seasons, blessings on the earth, and great joy amongst the fairy folk, for they rejoice in love, 
Now the balance of masculine and feminine returns with this commitment to honor the other and to give and receive their love with honor in the sacred space. Work with the sacred oil spark dark. When this card comes up, as it represents the exchange and honoring between masculine and feminine, the sacred union of partners deeply in love and devoted, a proposal to develop a lineage, kindred, and ancestors of the future, and a new kind of family based on loving equality and honoring, physically, spiritually, mentally, emotionally. All right, so Libra, that is a message for you. That's all I have for you. And if you want to see more content for your sign, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Goodbye, guys.